welcome back. Um, I'm doing a collaboration today. I know this is probably yeah the most craziest intro, and I look like a hot mess. But you know what? We got back from vacation yesterday, and we had therapy today. Uh oh, sister. So um, you know, it's it was kind of a crazy morning. Hold on, let me get her occupied. Selfie mode because you guys know how life is sometimes. Anyway, you guys, um, Purple Alphabet, she has one of my favorite um, learning channels, is doing a collaboration today. Um, I'll link her below. I love her channel um, for like learning activities for kids. And it is your three favorite um, back to school items uh, for kids. Um, so I really like collaborations like this because I like to see what everybody else likes. But anyway, um, we homeschool, so I think our favorites are a little bit different than everyone else's. So I try to make them um, favorites that everyone else could use. Um, and then I think I might do a separate video of like our homeschool favorites, you know what I mean? Um, so I'll link that below if I do do it, but I'll definitely link below Purple Alphabet's channel. She has one of my favorite channels. Um, and please stay and subscribe to my channel because normally, you know, I look like a human being sometimes, let's be real. Um, and I do different videos on, you know, homeschool learning, DIYs, you know, mom stuff. Anyway, thanks for watching and here's a video. So this right here is my favorite, um, my number one favorite. Um, this was from Target Dollar Spot. Um, I want to say, um, it was $3 and this is actually a chalkboard so you can write on it and we're obviously learning time. My son's only in kindergarten and you can write chalk like, you know, 5, 10, 15, whatever you want. And I take this off the wall and he can play with it and we put it back up. It fits in his homeschool space, which isn't the neatest right now, but you know, it is what it is. We're deep in school. So anyway, I totally recommend this if you can still find one. If not, I'll try to find something and link it online, but it was only like $3 at the Target dollar spot. All right, so um, favorite number two is this whole setup right here. I have a whole video I'm gonna put on about like what we're doing to help him learn states because we travel along the East Coast a lot. If you can't see by our little stars, that's actually where we travel. Um, but I really love um, all of these things like together as a unit, I guess. If you're learning uh, puzzles or puzzles, yeah, well, yes, or like maps or things like that. Um, that may not necessarily be part of your curriculum. We homeschool, so it is part of our curriculum. Um, but if you just want to learn more about states, um, this right here and this, I actually saw these, there's my phone going off, um, on Purple Alphabet's Instagram. Um, and I had to look a lot, like really, really hard actually for this, but I actually found them all. This um, was $3 at the dollar spot um, at Target. And my son loves putting this puzzle together. This is just dry erase. Um, see? And um, you can, you know, name all the states and I have this uh, above it. This was $3 at the dollar spot at Target as well. This was a dollar at Dollar Tree. You guys, I don't know if you watched any of my other videos before, but I was looking for a map like this, like nice and colorful. And I was going to pay like $10 on Amazon until I found this at Dollar Tree. Always, you know, Dollar Tree is always there to save you. But anyway, um, that was a dollar. And then this right here is actually for free. I learned at one of my homeschooling sites that you can actually um, go to the Department of Transportation for the state that you need and they will send you a map. It's actually like a road map, but regardless, it's still the state that you live in. So um, I highly recommend that too because it was uh, for free. So I guess this is kind of a bundle of items, but um, taller, taller, uh -huh. Target Dollar Spot has been like so good to us this year. And thank you to Purple Alphabet for like mentioning these things because it's been super awesome. I had to look for this. I don't know how long you guys, but anyway, yes, that's, uh-huh. <laughs> All right, back to school favorite number three. These are um, book bags. This is my where I keep my little stockpile, if you haven't noticed about this toilet paper behind there. And then we hang this little hook, by the way, storage solution, um, for his little um, uh -huh, aprons for like the build, building workshops and then our library bag with library books. But anyway, this is his book bag for this year. Um, and then I also got one um, for my daughter um, to travel and stuff. Um, these are from holler.com. Here's the box right here. And I keep preaching holler.com because I love it so much. Um, I do a lot of, and that's my alarm going up, you guys. Best video ever. Anyway, I do a lot of videos um, where like I mentioned things I got on holler because I love it. Um, it's really inexpensive and the stuff, you know, you can find like neighbor and stuff on there. I'll link it below if you're interested on, you know, like, just looking at stuff. But anyway, their back to school stuff is really inexpensive. This book bag um, is a tiny bit smaller, but it still fits all of his folders. I'll show you. And it's sharks, and it was only three bucks. We homeschool, but we also have a book bag so we can take it, you know, on the road and everything. And so, you know, he gets to pick it out. And then this one's Minnie Mouse, and it was only five bucks, which is a fraction of the price um, that we were um, paying. So if you travel or you need a book bag for school still or Anything like that. I really love Holler for a bunch of their school supplies and different like learning activities. They have Melissa and Doug products actually for 
um, a discounted price too. So I'm not really sure if this is my favorite is their book bags or just the website. Can it be the website? I don't know. Anyway, you guys, I really love this book bag and it was only $3, so check it out. This is an elephant. Yes. And this is like a chicken. Mm hmm. This is like a cat. Good job. Yes, it is. Wait, this one is chicken again. And this is a, this is a puppy. Good job. And that's one of your homeschool favorites. High five. We can play this. You, you want to show them your map? That is puzzle. You yeah. want to do the puzzle? Yeah, let's do the puzzle. So that's it, you guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please check out Purple Alphabet. I'll link her below. And I know that her video is going to have a list of everyone else participating um, so that you can, you know, check out other stuff and what everybody else likes. And I'll also link below my video to my three homeschool favorites that are kind of more like homeschool specific. But definitely check out her video. I love all of the learning ideas that she has. And that is it. Please stay and subscribe. Bye, y'all. Love you. And thanks for watching.